Hello everybody, welcome back to another part of Super Stingy's Roll. Um, this should be the last part. We're gonna be going through the fifth world as Vera. Last part was the painful experience of doing it as Sammy. I was uh, not happy to be stuck playing with him again. There's a lot of levels in this world that I know for a fact it's not gonna make a lick of difference which one I'm playing as, so uh, look forward to that if you didn't see the last part. Uh, the gauntlet's gonna suck no matter what. Okay, this as an example. I didn't really hit very many trees. Hit the tree. I want the coins. Hit there in the original. It wasn't the speed hoop. There was something else there to get you across. Oh yeah, it was just one of the speed launchers. So they got rid of his spring, which I mean, I guess you don't really need his Vera. So now that I'm doing these back to back, I can recognize exactly what's changed. Oh, there's no switches anymore. You don't need them. This spring. And then we can make it here. Alright, first try, and this is, uh, there is no Raspberry as Vera, and there's no ranking, so I just have to go. Well, this level I assumed was probably not going to be that bad. This one's a 50-50 shot, and the others I'm expecting to all be terrible. Fourth one I actually think is probably going to be worse as Vera, but it depends on how they change the level design. Uh, these thin platforms still aren't great for Vera. They kept the uh, birds there, and I'm sure they just knew that everybody's just gonna glide over and be like, yeah, whatever. Well, we know, just do it. You got this far. Doesn't have checkpoints. It's definitely gonna start being an issue soon. I don't know if it's gonna be too bad in this stage. But something like the gauntlet is gonna be horrible. That level was massive. It took me three and a half minutes as a Sammy. It's the one level I refuse to S plus. I don't care. I'm not going back through that pain. It took me like an hour just to beat it normally. Besides, I, I got a regular S on it and I got the S, uh, not this, but like the Maestro rank on one of the levels, so like, that bounces it out as far as I'm concerned. Better just go. It'll feel so much better playing as Vera. Just, just gotta say that again. Really don't know why they didn't just have Vera, or at least Vera's control set, like as like the main protagonist. So much more enjoyable. Okay, points I could. Now, see me, I was grappling against the wall. I can't do that anymore. So this is the best I can do. Uh-oh. Better be some coins. There is. Not a lot, but there is coins. This nightmare. Um, once again, I was just grappling against the wall before. Honestly, flying seems to be faster, so it's fine. I think this was like the last real floor. But there is like the one after this, but there's barely anything on it. But maybe this is like the second to last. I don't know. Find out in a second. Not nope, yeah, no. This is the last one. The last main one. These are too short to be anything but. 
And there's this Magistic Warner. Alright. Those were the ones I didn't think were going to be too bad. Let's go! Climbing Cliff Chase. Now, I found out as a Sammy, you can skip the Ghost Girl here. It's not like the third sta world stage. Oh, they... Oh, they changed the level design here. So you have to, oh wait, no, they didn't. Which of those were the original? So it might not actually be feasible to. Uh... No, you can glide from here. I can't, but I didn't have the height for it. Try ground pound. So I know, like, if you're on that last platform, that's too close. The last uh, reddish one. Okay, made it. I'm getting my war flashbacks. There's only one penguin here, is uh, Vera. No, 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 no! Mm. Yeah, this level's gonna blow. On me. Why do I even care? Flames probably don't mean anything to Vera, so why am I trying so hard to avoid it? It's costing me time, among other things. That's the second half of the stage I learned how to get through with the uh, with the flames anyway, so. That's not only coming. And I missed almost every coin there. That's not good. I think I have to take this path now. Just so I can get the extra coins. At least I think there's extra coins here. Is there? There really isn't. Like that last bit, like that was it. Or it just so uh, mixes in with the main path. What am I doing? Why am I trying to skip that again? Four seconds. We got three of the four. I think coins like that happened a lot of same me as well, so Thumb killed me. Thanks, Stun, for helping for once. You're never gonna help me ever again, so might as well thank you now. Definitely not gonna help him next stage. Yeah, like I predicted, this is where everything gets terrible. It's definitely better as Vera, but it's still abysmal. Is getting poked in the eye really any better than getting poked in the brain? Like, is it really? Oh, 
I remember being so excited when I was playing as uh, Sammy, like, oh, what are these balloons going to do? Nothing. They do nothing. They are active hazards, is Vera. I got through the first two stages in five minutes. It's already been that long here, and I haven't had, even had the chance to get up to that uh, stupidly long ice rail thing. I've come close a couple times. I've come close once. Oh, no, no, bad. Bad game is being bad again. The character you just can't get over your bad habits, candy game. Okay, got over here. I'm just going straight for the balloons this time. The coins you get really aren't worth it. Let's go. I know I'm close when I have the three birds in a row. Which is coming up. Okay. No! I don't have a choice. I have to go down. Do not fall down. I'm not going to make it. There were coins right there. It didn't matter. So close. Three birds in a row is the last major obstacle of the stage. I was my. I was nowhere near the B button. I was just feeling out where it just was like getting up. That's how it felt, and that was nowhere near the stomp. I'm gonna mock that one with the controller because my Xbox controller has rarely done that on other games. Seems to definitely happen more of Sammy, but uh. It has happened. I was hoping the drop shadows would line up. They did not. It happens. I need to jump over a coin, but other than that, everything is good. So far. Yeah, I can make that glide. Okay, I'm back here. More time than I've had on any of these attempts, and of course I throw it away. With a bad jump. Like, I, I couldn't glide to the balloon. I'm not even entirely sure what I did wrong. Like, you really, like... Something like that, like in points of like, yeah, that's where I screwed. Like, that's not like, nah. Like, I can only point to the game and just say it, it broke.
Hit me. No, not gonna make it. No, this sage's fixation is with these slippery, narrow platforms. It makes the stage so much worse. Blue side is the last time I'm ever gonna have to be in an ice stage after that. I never have to think about this crap again. And I won't! Desperately trying to keep that alive, and it just wasn't happening. Edge. And the blood straight going backwards. Those coins. Those flames! For some reason, they're harder to skip this better than they are, Sammy. Like, how does that happen? Bad. Bad flames. Oh no, the long pieces are here. That was really bad news. Like, that sealed the deal. Like, I need those longer ones to readjust my camera and everything. I didn't have that luxury. We're only two minutes into the video, but I'm recording this immediately after part two of uh, the last part. So I'm sorry if I sound like really frustrated and fed up with this stage in particular. It's because I am. Even worse, because I was stupidly close and one dumb mistake cost me the whole thing. Like, I'll own up that one. Like, that was uh, me screwing up. Even if it was only barely. But I haven't been able to get back up there since. Uh oh. Yeah, that that's a death sentence whenever you do the wall jump. So it never gives enough height. I'm not doing good at all this time. I'm missing coins left and right. Yeah, no. <laughs> that was the final straw. Even if I somehow saved that, I would have wasted so much time. Wouldn't have even made it to the checkpoint. Maybe I should try actually taking advantage of their strengths. Let's see the time's about the same. Might as well just do that. If I uh, make it a point to hit that balloon, there's no real risk of it falling. Land on that one? Yes! No! You're not landing that time. Sometimes it gives me control, sometimes it doesn't. That time it didn't. Playing that game. Uh, 
Nope. Not playing that game either. Not a fun game. Time. Nope, not bad. And I'm still locked. That actually hasn't happened this level for a while. It's, unless it's fire. Spare fire, it does that basically every turn. Still not worth the pain of trying to skip it. Say that maybe it is. I'm just curious if that's that voluminous board. No, it's really not. So I can only assume its use is. Uh oh, it's still locked. This is the developers of Super Saiyan World. Thank good game design is. This is why I don't invite the developer Super Sammy World to develop anything ever again. At least if I'm a platformer. I really hate that fire, but it's not worth it. Not as Vera. Same me was worth it. Don't get tri stun locked. Uh oh. This is exactly what I said don't do. That is literally what I said not to do. You got stunned three times. Make it now. There was a slim chance I could have saved that if I could have made it to the wall. But alas. See, maybe I should just go for this after all. Let's get the coins. It's not like it wastes that much time. And I have been pretty tight on time. Plus, at least I'm more prepared for that so I don't get triple stunned again. Nope, nope, bad. Bad game. Nope, bad. The game had to get its uh, triple sun lock in somewhere. I wasn't even sure if it was a super samey roll anymore if it didn't. Okay, well, I finally made it back here again. That only took, what, like, uh, 100 attempts? The sad thing is I can't even tell if it's a joke or not. And I missed the balloon. Again. Oh, oh, oh. No more snow. I'm a desert. I don't want snow. It's not good. The desert stage was way better than this. There, meet it again. Okay. I'm on my way to skewer to the right this time. It paid off. Get back on there. I'm not falling off now. Plus, however much I get from the coins. Oh, 
It is the triple birds. Like the last time. I think the only real obstacle left is falling off the edge. Made it. Let's go. I never have to look at that snow in this game ever again. <sighs> okay, I had to cool down for a minute there. That was uh, tense. Yeah, okay. Time for two more super tense levels. I have no clue how this one's going to work as Vera. First off, a lot of it was tied to the swimming, but also... Ugh. This level's timer was rough. Sorry, not the actual timer. No, that wasn't too, too bad. The rough part was uh, the lava rising. It is nice being able to skip over things like that, but does it make it worth it? No, of course not. They didn't put anything in to get around the spike. Oh no. I have to damage boost. But it's the only way. Also, I was wondering before, but now I know for a fact like I need those points. Is <laughs> Vera. Why does it keep glitching on that? Why is the stage in general just bugged as Vera? More than Sammy. Which is weird. Considering it's already like one of the buggiest games I've ever played. And I've been in games like uh, Bubsy 3D to basically 100%. And yeah, now this is buggier. It is not even a close contest. Nope, bad. I wasn't recovering from that. Glide, jump, 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 glide. There's a spring here. Ah, that is the worst. The timer is not much better. I don't know what the LAB thing is supposed to mean. Maybe it should have been LDB, lava down below. Escape from LDB. <laughs> yeah, that fits way better. I can get the points on both those sides, but uh, I can't. Want work for once. Works pretty well that time. Probably about the best I can realistically expect out of this game. Spring. I probably could have just glided there. Ah. Okay, well, that's where the first checkpoint was. Oh, they got rid of the, uh, what's gonna call it? Switching. Good. It was a dumb obstacle that never should have been there. Honestly, the tubes are obstacle enough. I was thinking I might need the coins, which I do need the coins, but. I don't have time to get them. Doesn't matter if I need them.
for the... Oh, not the luxury. Nah. <laughs> Once I got hit by the spike, it was over. Get up. That was painfully slow. I don't think I'll make it now because of that, but I'm gonna keep trying. Make that no. No, I cannot. Ooh, that was close. Are you kidding me? Ugh. I desperately need points in this stage, and this stage just doesn't provide them. Or when they do provide them, it takes so long that it's not worth it. I know this is a massive issue, and the timer is barely any better. Okay, the game bugged. Again. Super Saiyan and bugging. Go figure. I'm not even sure if this game ever could function properly. No, except for World 1, where it actually, actually works. Pretty sure like 90% of the game's development time went to World 1. And like another 15% went into World 2. So like, oh crud, that's right, we didn't finish. Uh, it's okay. No one's gonna get this far anyway. I got that far. Set. You roll boats now, it's apparently safer. Or something, I don't know. Land on spring, good. Uh oh. Time is rough. I wanted those so bad, but the love is right up against me. Honestly, I should have taken one of the pipes. I should have just taken the L. Flip them. Nope. Wasn't even trying to pause there, but it was perfect timing. Trying to adjust my camera, it's just the buttons are so close.
I'm emotionally prepared to go through the gauntlet today. I might have to do this one in two parts too. Literally just for one part. Maybe if my Sandy is completely gone, I'll try S plus ranking it as Sammy, but don't hold your breath on that one. That's not happening. It's like, that's something I'll go for if my Sandy's fully, truly gone. Also, if my city's gone, the next game I do is going to be an HRG. Which it probably won't, because I have games I want to cover. Like, I mentioned way back when I wanted to do the Planilla in two parts. Like, I did the Dwarf Fane Wild part, but I didn't do the Lunatase Bale part. I really want to get around to that. I don't think it's going to be the next game I cover. I can probably guess what the next game is I'm going to cover. kind of hoping I could have Xenoblade 3 done before that, but it's definitely not going to happen, so rip. You need to glide on that. I'm wasting time with that. They load in this time! You mean that was a glitch? <gasps> Say it isn't so! A glitch in my Super Sammy roll? No, that's not possible. I wonder if I was gliding over the low trigger for those enemies. <laughs> it's very possible. Nope. Way too fast for me to be making minor mistakes like that. This basically has to be a perfectionist run. Minor mistakes are allowed, but that's it. Could not roll onto the spring. Why didn't I just go to full speed? Yeah, why didn't I go to full speed? I don't know, maybe because I would have gone full speed. If that makes too much sense for you, I'm sorry. You're too far into this game. gone a lot better. And I missed some coins on that round up. I might need the tube. We'll see. I think I have to glide on the first one. Second one I... well I already proved the second one I don't need to. The first one I do. Switch. And mind you, it's not exactly hard to kill Vera in this, they just jump down. But you know what I mean. Like, just a keybind button. Like, maybe like the right thumbstick or something. Doing good for the tunnel. Nope. Wasn't saving that. I 
I can barely even get to the part of the level that I was going to be grateful for. It's just the time limit in the lava rising is so rough. And don't even get me started on how scared I am of the gauntlets. Okay, I don't think he tunneled this time, though it's still not going great. Land, please land. I got a good few points out of that. Oh, but I didn't realize how high the lava had gotten. I got stopped by the button. Doesn't happen a lot, but it does happen. It's possible. Go, go, go. Pound and glide. I'm pretty sure that's the best I'm ever going to optimize that area, so. I can't. I can't. I even got the coins for it. Handy. Doing better on coins this time than I have been in a while. Thanks to that. Stop for anything. If I was gonna see me, that would have been bad. And jump. Remember to cut the corners. Except for this one, because I want the extra coins. And jump. Okay, I'm good, I think. I'm good. I made it. One stage left to go. I just gotta get through the gauntlet. Let's go! <sighs> okay, let's get I had to take another break. Alright, time for the level I'm easily the most scared of. And it's purely down to length. Oh, so oh they were evil. I, I was worried about that. Yeah, um... Leamy had the like, two and a half minutes, I think, in the stage. Barrett gets 20 seconds. I remember it was specifically citing this exact fear. And they ended up doing that exact thing. I'm gonna have to glide into that spring. Oh no. Hey, they are not giving me breathing room. Hey, it's bad enough that I don't get to go through checkpoints. Come on, hit spring. Okay. Come on. No, I don't have time to dilly. Land. Don't have time for that either. I actually need the speed booster now. Oh, uh, yeah, I did. This area is unsurprisingly the exact same. Most well, that first checkpoint area, but time is going to become a bigger and bigger concern as the stage goes on.
Nossa, que... Ok. Just barely don't get enough height to, uh, to glide to the part with the ring. I did it again. The coins. Nope. No good. Nope, not enough time to screw around with that. Not until I barely survived, if I survived. Why well, sometimes that works great and other times it doesn't even seem to try. What? Hmm? Hmm? No. Close to the start button. Okay. It happens, I guess. Especially in Super Sammy Roll of all games. Where Crab Claw is the norm. For the hit spring, good. I couldn't save that. Stupid one pixel. Bear some sometimes feels even looser than Sammy, which is really bad. Uh, this part's actually harder as Vera. It's a uh, uh, same me I was just using the tongue exploit. This part's probably gonna suck because of that. Like that's the only way I got through that. Come back for the, another shot.
Step in there and trying to fiddle around the jump and hope that it works. For the I can already feel there's going to be another two day part. I just don't have it in me to, uh, to keep grinding attempts out. I'm not even getting to the final checkpoint. I'm just Screwing up on the first one. The spot of death is. Good news is, next part after this is. Pretty easy, or at least it was for Sammy, so uh, it's the Majora's Mask section as I was calling it. Nope! Hey, well, I saved it, but I lost a lot of time. Time that I don't have for some reason. Still in for nature on that one, Devs. No, bad. My two minutes is already stupidly strict. So what made you think the 20 seconds was okay? Mm -hmm. What I end up doing too is I think I might just uh, stop top recording and then I'll do like a post commentary over a successful attempt. Or if I get really upset, I might pull an Octopath and just load up a speedrun and watch what they do. Like, they have level by level speedruns for both characters on this game, on speedrun.com. That's completely viable. As far as I'm concerned, I beat the game when I got all the achievements anyway. Which, uh, yeah, the last achievement uh, was the, uh, the rainbow outfit one. So this whole part has basically just been a hypothetical. Which yes, is very similar to reasoning to what I used for Octopath. I was like, I mean, I technically beat the game when I beat everybody's stories. And, and, okay. And please, no. You know what? Let's go look at that speedrun, shall we? Okay, there was only one run up for uh, Vera on this stage. There was a few for Sammy. So I'm kind of curious to check those too. But this is uh, the real Chopper Gun that you were playing on the PS5 version. They did it in 129.39. Let's see how they did. Okay. Okay, so far it just seems like really fast optimized versions of what I was doing. Like, technically nothing I couldn't have done. Okay, yeah, then that... Okay, that's impressive. <laughs> that's also impressive. That's something I never thought to do and I feel really stupid for not. Something I should have done and never did. Because I was too scared of running out of time. That, I was just too nervous, and yeah, at this point onward, I just never made it. So yeah, this part level's different. They just put some springs in. 
This is way different. Okay, here's the part that was the final checkpoint. Are the spikes still there? No, they're not. Okay, they got rid of the spikes. They had the sense to do that. I figured they were going to have more springs, but they didn't. Okay. Like, it makes sense to do that with that moveset. And you're basically at the end. Oh, this is so cathartic to watch. I just gotta say. You're at the end. Congratulations on your world record chopper. Well earned. 129.39. And she. I do like to, like, I noticed, like, there was, like, the, the Nitro Red Super Sammy roll on the corner. It's like, no. 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 I don't want to think about this game ever again. I am done. I am uninstalling this from Steam as we speak. I show it here. In case you don't believe, like, here. Click Properties. Yeah, there's a option to uninstall in here somewhere, I think. Isn't there? I'm uninstalling as soon as I find out how. There it is. Uninstall. I don't like Steam's UI. It's messy. Yes, yeah, see you in the next LP whenever that is. Or is it going to play 3? So I uh, take care, stay safe, have a good one. Bye bye